Hello, my name is Randy. I have a 2009 Chevy Impala for sale. It's the LT version with the leather and everything. Leather loaded, sunroof. But I'll make a little YouTube video and do a walk around and a little test drive for you. That way you can see more about the car. The car isn't perfect. It's got some imperfections. You can see right here. Uh, there's a little bitty scrape or dent there. Along, it looks like, I don't know, maybe the previous owner might have hit something. I buy and sell cars. This car was a new car trade-in at uh, Everett GMC. I believe the car used to belong to, uh, oh, by the way, it's got ice, ice cold air conditioning. Um, the, uh, the car has the wood grain uh, dash. It has a couple of issues. Um, our lights lit up here. Uh, I think for one, I, when I when I check the pressure in the tires, it's it's not reading one of the tires, like the sensor is not working or the sensor is is um, is out. I'm I'm just not sure. Um, and I don't know if that's affecting it or what, but the ABS light is on, and the traction control. Now I talked to someone and they told me if it can't read a tire sensor. It thinks your tire's flat, so these other lights will come on, but I don't know if that's true. Um, let's see here, what else? I, oh, um, I did check this. It said that it needed a um, cam position sensor. I haven't bothered with that because it runs just fine. But if somebody wants to put a cam position sensor in, they're not very expensive or hard to put in. I believe that uh, family must have owned this because we, there was a lot of little crayon, melted crayons in the car, and uh, we cleaned it up a little bit. It does have heated seats. Okay, let's take this for a little test drive. That's 20, 30, that's 40, that's 50. I'm not going to get up too fast because I'm in town. That's 60. You can see the steering wheel is nice and smooth. Uh, runs, runs very good. Uh, like I said, I buy and sell cars. Um, I've got two locations. One is in Danville. That's where I'm shooting this video. The other is in uh, Waveland, um, also known as Blue Mountain Lake area which is about 15 minutes from Boonville. Um, depending on where you're coming from, I can try to work it out so that we have the car um, closer to wherever you're coming from. For example, if you're coming from Little Rock, we'll have it in Danville, or if you're coming from Fort Smith, we'll have it in Waveland. Uh, but um, anyway, like I said, this was a new car trade-in. Uh, I think it's gonna make a pretty nice little car. Uh, runs and drives very well. If you're interested in coming out and taking a look at it, feel free to give me a call or text message. Thank you very much.